Hi, I'm Priyanka Gautam and welcome to Priyanka's Pachala. So today I am your Jolly Phonics and Jolly Grammar instructor. Today I'm going to tell you about what is a Jolly Grammar especially. Why we need to learn Jolly Grammar and how much it is effective for the children. So for that, it is a very much fun full method to teach the kids because there are some uh, patterns, there are some colors, there are some actions to teach the kids. So if you want to know about more this jolly grammar, parts of speech and tenses, everything, quickly do subscribe my channel and hit the like button so that you will get my upcoming videos for that. So let's get started to see about what is a noun. So first we'll see about what is a proper noun and what is a common noun, what is the color of it and what are the action for this. So let's get go. Here is a noun jingle. The jingle is a noun names a person, a noun names a thing, a noun names a person, place, things or idea. So, so shake it to the left and shake it to the right. Find yourself a noun, feel just right. So let's see, this is a noun jingle my friend, a noun jingle my friend. You can shake it to the left and shake it to the right. Find yourself a noun and then recite. Okay, so let's see what is a proper noun. Here we I have mentioned two definitions of the proper noun and common noun so that we can we are having a clear idea about it. The first is a proper noun. A proper noun is a proper name of people, places, things or animals. For example, I have mentioned over here the name of a person that's a hero. Name of a place, India. Name of a thing, that's a Samsung phone. And name of animal, that is Tom. Now, what is a common noun? The common name, common noun means the common name of people, places, things or animal. Because if we can just think like that, the thing is common. Like there are many things. Like for example, here they have mentioned boys. So there are many boys. I'm not talking about any particular one. So that is a common noun. Girl, many girls are there, that's a common noun. City, there are many cities, it's a common noun. Phone, we are using phone with the different different companies. I have not mentioned over here the name of the company, so that is a common noun. Next is a dog, many dogs are there. Cat, many. So these all are common nouns. Now let's get, let's it go. Here I have mentioned some names and four bowls with the person, places, things and animals so we can differentiate it and we'll get it which are nouns that are this. Now here we have an action for the proper noun. So see the two fingers on your forehand that is an action for the proper noun. Here we have an activity for that. The first we need to draw an envelope as it is mentioned over here downside. So you need to draw an envelope and on the envelope you can write your address because if you are going to write your address so that address is also a proper noun and proper noun always begins with the capital letter so don't forget that okay now the next here we have some more examples for the proper noun here's the name of a person Mahatma Gandhi ji who is one only so that is a proper noun. The Taj Mahal, that's a name of a place, which is one only. So it begins with a capital letter. Name of a boy, Jack. I'm not talking about any boy. I'm talking about the particular boy whose name is Jack. So Jack is also a proper noun. And the next is the name of a phone. Which company phone do I have? So I have a phone of Samsung company. So Samsung is also a proper noun. I hope you got about it that what is a proper noun. Now next we have an action for the common noun. So four fingers on your forehead. That is an action for the common noun. Now you are thinking about what is a color. See there are many types of noun but today we are going to discuss about the proper and common noun. So the noun color is black actions i told you as i have mentioned about proper and common that we can do the actions now here we have one activity for that first is the blank is black 
what is black you can say any noun like uh, the board is black the table is black the chair is black anything you can use i throw the ball so you can use any noun over here number three a uh, blind can swim a duck can swim a boy can swim a fish can swim next is i like to eat what do you like to eat i like to eat pizza burger everything in junk food what do you like you have to say that okay so you can mention any any noun over here so just think about it now whatever nouns we have used in these blanks which nouns are this think so these all are the common nouns here i have one activity for you for the common like we have done one activity for the proper noun to draw an envelope we have mentioned our address which begins with the capital letter so that is a proper noun here one activity for the common noun that is according to the jolly grammar so we have to draw one camera paper camera you just pretend that that is your original camera and then you have to click a picture with that camera whatever thing is around you in your room on your table anything three to four pictures you need to click like i'm going to click a picture of this window this laptop this notebook this pen this cartoon so what are these whatever picture i have taken that pictures are common nouns so it's very much easy for us now to identify what is a common and what is a proper so just think whatever pictures you can click these all are the common and if you are going to say the particular name of that pictures that is a proper like for example i'm clicking a picture of this laptop so that's a common but if i will say i have a lenovo laptop so lenovo is proper so i hope you have understood about what is a proper noun and what is a common noun now here we are going to do one activity for that are you ready let's get started first i'm going to say you the nouns and you have to show me an action i will also show you with uh, show you the first noun is india which noun is it this so this is an action for the proper next is country there are many countries so you can show action like this it's a common right the next is phone apple phone then plant then city bangalore table fridge samsung fridge notebook pencil apsara pencil so i hope you understood about what is a common and what is a proper if you like my video do subscribe do hit the subscribe button and there will we are going to meet you again to with the new parts of speech and new video thank you so much for that have a nice day